Five starting berths to the 2017 Champion of Champions will be decided on Sunday night when the Z Wayne Griffin Director Trials are contested at Los Alamitos Racecourse. The lineup of horses in the trials it is an outstanding one. Here's the rundown of some of these top names. Zooming for Spots is a winner of the 2016 Champion of Champions and most recently won an allowance event at Los Alamitos. Owned by Jim Walker and trained by Monte Arosa, Zooming for Spots won his birth to last year's Champion of Champions by winning a Z Wayne Griffin Director's Trial. He loves this race and is exiting his first win of the season. Bodacious Eagle has been one of the top quarter horses in the nation the entire year. He won the Leo Stakes at Remington Park earlier this year and has been a top grade one performer all year long. The millionaire He Looks Hot is the winner of the Spencer Childers Championship Handicap in July and will also compete in the Z Wayne Griffin Director's Trial. He's looking to run in the Champion of Champions for the second straight year. Reliance Ranches and trainer Mike Robbins have several outstanding horses in the Z Wayne Griffin Director's Trial. One of their top runners from the barn is Big Lou, the third place finisher in last year's Champion of Champions and winner of the 2016 Los Alamitos Super Derby. Big Lou was third to Bodacious Eagle in the Leo Stakes earlier this year. Two other Reliance Ranch's runners are the Charm of Corona, second in the Vessels Maturity, and Flash and Bling, winner of the Bank of America California Championship Challenge. One Street Racy was second in this year's All-American Derby, and now this filly will test her medal against older horses in the Z Wayne Griffin Trials. Outstanding older mares Just Good Reason and Just Raven will also participate in the Z Wayne Griffin Trials. Just Good Reason won the Charge of Our Handicap in January, while Just Raven has the Miss Princess Handicap among her stakes wins in 2017. Another top quarter horse competing in Sunday's trial is B.H. Lisa's Boy who is already in the Champion of Champions after winning the Los Alamitos Winter Championship and Vessels Maturity. The Bill Hobart owned and trained runner had surgery after the Vessels Maturity, but has returned to the track and will use Sunday's race as preparation for the Champion of Champions. His appearance in this race does not affect the starting birds available in the Z Wayne Griffin Director's Trial. The weekend action will also feature the running of the $20,000 Corona Chick Handicap, featuring the sensational filly Chowchilla Chickadee. She's won her first three career starts, all of them in wire-to-wire -wire daylight fashion. She'll face Autumn Handicap winner Justa Cartel. And two unfortunate notes to report. Mr. Jess Perry, one of the all-time leading sires, died on Wednesday at the age of 25 due to complications from laminitis. He was the sire of world champion apolitical Jess and champions one famous eagle, Matabari and Notoni. I'm a fearless hero, the champion two-year-old gelding in 2015, and that year's winner of the Los Alamitos 2 million futurity was also laid to rest on Wednesday due to complications from Ringbone. Racing for S Quarter K LLC, I'm a fearless hero also won the PCQHRA Breeders Futurity and won over $1 million on the track.